Today we're taking a look at the Acer Predator Vesta 2 DDR5 memory kit. This kit is for high performance gaming PCs. It runs DDR5 6000 CL32. Thanks to Acer for sending this over for us to take a look at. This kit in particular is designed to work with both AMD and Intel systems as the kit comes with an XMP and Expo profile. The kit consists of two memory modules, each 16 gigabytes for a total of 32 gigabytes. I'll be using this in my standard test bench, which is on the AM5 platform with the Ryzen 9700X CPU and the ASRock X670E PG Lightning motherboard. I'll definitely be making use of that Expo certified profile for maximum performance. This DDR5 6000 CL32 memory kit will provide a decent bump in performance for most of the recent AAA gaming titles while having some solid RGB and absolutely huge heatsinks. Since the Expo presets are baked into the memory profiles, all you really need to do in order to enable the Expo mode is go into the BIOS, select Expo, and you're ready to go. For my test system here, I'll be using the 9700X and pairing that with my ASUS RTX 4070 Super. These days, for new gaming rigs, I really see 32GB being the best value for performance and cost as far as memory goes for most people. 32GB of system memory is definitely going to last you quite a few years as well. As for the RGB element on this memory kit, if you're running a newer AMD Ryzen system, which you would for DDR5, I definitely think the lighting element is a nice accent to a fully specced out gaming rig. As for performance, I know that I've mentioned this in the past, but if you're going to get into a newer platform, especially the AM5 platform and the Ryzen 9000s, going with the stock JDEC 4800 mega transfer per second memory is probably not worth the cost savings, and it's definitely not going to have that premium look if you're building a nice gaming rig. In my opinion, DDR5 6000 is still the sweet spot for Ryzen 7000 and Ryzen 9000 CPUs, and you do have that opportunity to overclock this memory just a little bit at least. As far as increased performance from 4800 to 6000 CL32, I did notice a couple of gains that's actually a nice performance benefit for just turning on the Expo mode in the BIOS, especially when you consider the slight improvement in the 1% lows. This kit is of course RGB, so that's probably also worth like, what, 10 20% performance? Well, I wish, but the RGB definitely looks good on this kit. You can actually control the RGB lighting through various RGB applications. Acer lists Asus, Gigabyte, ASRock, and MSI software suites as being compatible. I would have to say that this is a solid overall memory kit that isn't going to break the bank in terms of budget, and I definitely think it adds that nice final touch to the aesthetic of a gaming PC in my opinion. I ran my system through some gaming benchmarks to make sure that we were stable and everything was performing well. No issues noted with the Expo speeds enabled, and like I said, I did notice a nice performance boost. I even got a couple extra FPS in the Wukong benchmark at 1080p very high. One thing to note though, if you are new to the AMD AM5 platform, when you initially boot your system up, especially when you turn on that Expo mode, your system will take a little bit longer than an AM4 system, for example, in order to boot up. Your system has to go through some memory training, especially on DDR5, so that's totally normal. I have to admit that before Acer had reached out to me about the Predator memory and storage lines that they offer, I didn't really know they were competing in this segment. As far as this memory kit goes, it definitely seems like some quality stuff, and the Predator line of DDR5 memory has a couple of other kit options as well going all the way up to DDR5-7200. While you can see that I definitely use this memory kit with my Ryzen 7 CPU, I would say that this would definitely work well with any Ryzen 5 or Ryzen 9 system, or on the Intel side, pretty much any recent Intel system. If you happen to be somebody that cares about the integrated GPU performance on one of the newer CPUs, those integrated GPUs are also going to benefit from these much higher speeds and tighter timings. As for the overall value, this kit is coming in at about 120 bucks on Amazon as of the publishing of this video. I think that's a really solid deal for some fast memory with good heat sinks, RGB, and a limited lifetime warranty. So if you like the way these look and you want to give the Acer memory a try, I'll have some links in the description below, so definitely head down there and check that out. If this video helped you out with your memory decision, definitely drop a like on it. That lets YouTube know to recommend this video to other people who are researching memory kits and are looking for options. If you're into PC 
PC gaming and the occasional home lab video, definitely get subscribed to the channel and ring that bell for notifications. Until next time, keep on gaming.